How's she going? It's Monday. We got all new bonus hunts. Seven days a week. And last week's seven days of bonus hunting, we actually ended in a profit, allowing me, the host, Bad News Andy, to go from being Bad News Andy to being Tiger Shirt Money Andy. So until such a time as we are no longer profitable, I'm wearing my Lucky Tiger shirt because we worked our asses off last week in order to secure that profit I had. It was like a beautiful mine. The numbers were just floating everywhere in the air. I was picking games. You know, the minus 75X cutoff for games were just floating by, just knocking games off of the shelf everywhere. And then after that Viking day, I thought we were screwed. I thought the Vikings had literally screwed us in terms of being profitable, but we pulled it out. We opened a book. We got literate. We got financially literate. My cup looks like, it looks like a prop from a poorly rendered video game. It's kind of like a, kind of like a bluish, hmm. Green screen just having its way with my mug and my tiger. Anyway, uh, we got a bonus cost today of $161. So if I want to keep wearing this shirt, that is what we need to achieve. Like I said, once we're no longer profitable, I'm going back to just being bad news, Andy. So... Let's, oh, we, yeah, before we get started here, I have this amazing selection of games, but I got to say, Rome, Caesar's Glory. Formerly, back when I was doing the weekly award shows, this was a most profitable game of the week one week. And as well, Four Diamond Blues by Megaways. I booted up those games, assuming that there would be some bonuses and some free spins to be had, but apparently my bonuses will be found elsewhere. So... Without any further ado, let's fire up a fresh week of bonus hunts. And we're starting <laughs> with Three Clown Monty. Yes, got it all ready to go. How about that? I think I'm going to need a bigger desk one of these days. This was a request from the YouTube comments. Happy to oblige. I don't know how I missed this game before, but I don't think I have enough games to do... Like a clown theme. I might be able to pull off a carnival because there's there's Divine Carnival and a couple other ones. I think there's a circus game or two, so I might be able to do something with it. If this game pays well, I'm going to be looking for an excuse to go play more uh, clown and circus games. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Yeah. Excellent. Scatter City. Oh. Pick a card. Any card. It's not the minimum. I'm happy. Places, people. That's where my standards are. Oh my God. Can we kick this off? Oh, geez. Okay. What did it say? I think I get Monty spins. I go to like a separate layer of the of the bonus free spins. Okay. Oh, nice. The maximum. Could be a pretty hot pick coming out of the YouTube comments right here. I like that it's sticky wilds and they're literally getting sticky from banana cream pies to the face. Gonna be decent. I'm digging the soundtrack. Okay. So we got, we got a nice set of gorillas right there. Hold the phone. As they used to say in the 90s. Holy shit. For set. Oh my god. My lucky tiger shirt. Was it the YouTube pick or was it the Lucky Tiger shirt? Let's see. We're up to 18, 19 bucks. I need, we got three more spins. That's a lot of gorillas. Okay, come on out, come on out. <laughs> All right. This is only the, like, the the bonus, the Monty spins. We got to go back to the actual bonus free spins after this. It's another 14 bucks. Oh, my God. How many more gorillas can we squeeze in this clown car? It is early in the morning where I am. I got up to 
finish this. And this is way more hype than I was expecting to walk into. Oh my god, well that's gonna be like at least 14 then, right? I'm just doing some fast math. Actually, I, I, no, that's not true because I needed, I want to say more donuts, but oh my gosh. No, the donut was actually in the way. All right, it's whatever, it's whatever. We got 45 bucks. And we got one more Monty spin, and then God knows what coming. This is only the first spin of the bonus. All right, okay, nice. Another gorilla, not the best. But I think those donuts are doing some work this time. Gonna be out of coffee here. Holy shit. This is madness. <laughs> I want to see that 25x gorilla pop off on something here. Oh my god, look at all the lines. The lines! Can we go for more? <sighs> Alright, I didn't punch my ticket into more Monty's, but... Oh my god, don't scatter tease me. Not this early. Come on, brother. Could have still made it a good line. <laughs> Come on. Ah. Uh, five X. No. Oh my God. Clutch Monty. <laughs> Clutch Monty sounds like. Well, sounds like the. Karma Sutra. <laughs> we did it again. Clutch Monty. All right. Oh, probably I got to pick again, right? Okay, let's go. Okay, we only have four, five, and six. Actually, I think that's what we had last time. I'm getting my card games confused. Oh, the minimum. One gorilla. Oh, yeah, just not enough time, not enough monkeys, not, not my monkeys, not my circus, I guess, on that one. But that's going to be 67.52. That's a 169x opener. We're definitely doing like a circus or a clown day later this week. I'm going to put that on the menu for sure. 169x opener. There we go. Damn. All right. That is sick. So that's okay. We're sub a hundred dollars on our bonus cost there right now. I forget how I randomly bumped into this game, but I wish I'd had it for the Egypt theme we did. But, well, you know, it'll be another one of those coming around, too. And actually, maybe this one's not going to be on that said upcoming Egypt theme day at some point because I'm not making a god. I'm making... Oh, is there a little bit? A little bit. Yeah, this is not paying out very well. Oh, yeah, and I think we missed the first spin because it had... This is one of those games where it jumps in automatically, so I had to hot tag that uh, close button. But... We'll call that a 20x multi. So I had fucked this game up uh, right here. Not going to sugarcoat the truth here. I went into this game. I wanted to see if it was going to be fast to spin for the bonus hump. And I had left the bonus at a dollar twenty, or the sorry, the bet at a dollar twenty-five, where it just had defaulted. And uh, sure enough, the very first spin it bonused, and it started automatically spinning. And so here we are <laughs> with a chance to make uh, make some bank for the uh, the channel, you know. Although maybe I'm not even going to get my buck 25 back. Oh, my God, really? Are you, am I going to pay the price of this karma? 
Okay. Ooh. Uh. Nice! Okay, yeah, I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm calculating the multiplier on this. Like, really, I'm, I'm a guy who's about multis. So, it's not gonna be uh, too crazy. But we might get a, a little chunk of change here. We got a 59.75, which is actually... Is actually a 48x. So, still a good bonus by, by any terms. Uh, right there, just the money a little askew, but I'll, I'll take that. I'll take that. That's a whole adds a couple of games in. All right. Anyway, forget about that. It's weird and different. We got a Hercules block because I was going to play Story of Hercules Expanded Edition because this is one of the games I'm trying to finish their map uh, by getting bonuses and see all that it has to offer. But then I decided, you know what? I'm going to play both of these because I'm already halfway through the non-expanded edition. So we're going to do them back to back here. Give them a little side-by-side -side comparison. Spinomenal. Simply phenomenal. I feel like they're explaining their joke a little bit. Like, we're going to call ourselves Spinomenal, but we want people to, like, make no confusion that it's a play on Phenomenal. Spinomenal. bum bum ba da da I think it was the aliens on Sesame Street. These do that phenomena. Anyway. Oh. Okay, well, looks like we're going to have a clutch stampede. See, it's it's early, and I don't have a lot of good cow jokes lined up, but it's going to be 810 right there. So we are walking away with 1318, which is going to be a 26x multi. So what we'll do, we will now and go and see. Oh, my God, where am I at here? We're going to see if the non-expanded edition can beat that. It's the Battle of the Brothers, the Hercules Brothers. We are very close to being profitable, too. But there's only two games to go. That's the scary part. My lucky tiger shirt. This is the, yeah, the expanding, okay. I forgot we're a stage ahead in this Hercules games rather than the other one, so maybe it isn't a totally fair comparison, but we'll see how they do. This is a game, though, that will give you this exact same big win animation on $4. Actually, I think it's $3.50 and up. That's not bad, though. Didn't I get that exact win over on the Expanded Edition? Math Nerd over here is going to go check out his instant replay. Semi-instant. Latent replay. We had 13-18 as our total on Hercules Expanded Edition. And we're going to have 13.25. So uh, the uh, the mini versus tournament here, uh, Story of Hercules Non-Expanded Edition is going to win by seven cents. Interesting. All right. Ascension Rise to Riches. I don't know why I'm so confident that this game can bonus well, but I've given it a couple of chances now. I think this is the third time I've played it, and I haven't really seen the big payoff, but this is probably going to be it, aside from maybe Egyptian Theme Day. That I totally just hatched that idea of doing that again and getting it on the schedule. So I'll figure it out. 
All right, not the minimum. This is the last game. God, we are at 162. We're profitable for the day. Hercules got us just over. We had a bonus cost 161. We're at 162. Do you do whatever you want, Rise of Riches? But you no, know, if you want, if you want to ever be seen again, you gotta pay me. <laughs> you gotta pay me a little bit right now. Sweeten the deal. I need a bribe. I'm out of coffee, and that break is breaking my heart. God damn it. <laughs> I'm just kind of in awe. You know, sometimes a game appears. Maybe that's what it is. This looks like, a, like you know, it's cool. The graphics are decent. They're a little, there's a little heavy black line on everything. But 272 is going to be a 7x for the epic conclusion over here. So we're going to finish off. Get out of here. All right. So like I was saying before we just kind of, you know, just kind of cruise through Ascension Rise to Riches right there. We had a bonus cost of $161. We just got back $165, which means we made $4. We're still profitable today. We're up. Tiger shirt money does it again. So I'm pretty happy about that. We got not a bad looking stack of multis. Definitely a way stronger start. Three Clown Monty was a sick pick. So I'm going to build a uh, like a circus or a clown day, whatever I can get, whatever I can figure out based around that. And we'll hammer that out a little bit later on this week. But yeah, not too bad a day of bonuses. So if you're not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button. We got seven day a week bonus hunts. And tonight is the thrilling conclusion. It is Sweet Bonanza. Is it worth it? Part le deux where we're going to be looking at the Sweet Bonanza bonuses, but we are checking the box and paying the extra dime per spin to double our odds of bonusing on that game. And we're going to prepare and compare these stats side by side with not having that button checked. So just a little, little way of sneaking more Sweet Bonanza in there in the week. And then hopefully the bonuses are as good or better than they were last time. We had um, an average multiplier of 71 on that on Friday's episode of Is It Worth It Sweet Bonanza? So I'm excited about that make your way over to mako casino play yourself some sweet bonanza check out some three clown monty all that good stuff make sure that you are gambling responsibly as well until next time stay safe and stay healthy